Hey guys, so today it's gonna be me drawing. Um, and this is a gangster girl drawing. We have a class scene going on in our school where we um, each second month or something like that have Maybe a... Maybe each quarter year-ish? Yeah. Something. Three, two, two. Three the deadline months. is very lenient usually. But we, we have a theme going on. Uh, this is the second issue. And it was gangster girls. And the requirement was that you needed to have at least two girls in a gang together. At least three girls? I at think... first it was at least three girls, but then because no one really uh, signed up to participate, she was like, yeah, I'll take whatever. Yeah, that's, that's true. Yeah. So this is a, um, not a parody, a what you call it? Caricature? A caricature of um, me and Victoria. You see us in the middle, that's Victoria I'm lining up <laughs> right now. Uh, and me besides that I'm lining up right now. And um, our friends to the side of us. Um, classmates. Yeah, yeah, various classmates. And then we are the queen of hearts and queen of spades. Yeah. Because that was a thing from all the way back in October. From Inktober. Yeah, right? yeah, before we started dating. I wanted to be cute and draw a heart on her hand because I had a crush on her, but she didn't understand that I had a crush on her. <laughs> um, so I, I tried my best. Yeah. But, no, but um, I mean, it was a thing back from Inktober because you drew yourself as the queen of spades yeah. because you were like, yeah, I want to be cool. And then I saw it and I was like, yeah, I want to draw that too. I want to be the queen of hearts. And we were like, yeah. Do it. <laughs> yeah, it was really cute. And for for a long while, we like, I would draw a heart on Victoria's hand, and she would draw like the spade on my hand because it was like a heart, but added in the little line. So, <laughs> and it was really cute. See, and we still do it every once in a while. And like, my family is like, why don't you just get a tattoo? And our friends are like, are you still doing that weird stuff? But yeah, I think it's they cute. say we are trying too hard. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I think it's cute. So I tried to be um, more cartoony in this drawing. I tried to do more of a... I was originally more inspired by Adventure Time and that sort of aesthetic, but sort of turned it into my own um, as it went along. And uh, um, I tried to use a mixture of clothes that we own and like made up stuff. So Victoria has a really cool leather jacket and I have some ripped jeans, but I don't have a leather jacket and I actually don't have a red tank top either, so so that's that's a lie too. <laughs> All the lies. Um, well, your ripped jeans is not intentionally ripped either. No, no, no. They're <laughs> actually ripped. It's, um, yeah. Fun story. Maybe um. another time. <laughs> <laughs> and then we just have us and to Victoria's side you can't really see it right now we have uh, our friend Stine who is very casual and that's Simona who loves Batman if you had not guessed she's like a major Batman <laughs> nerd and geek it's like as soon as you mention anything Batman she her head will like pop up and she will be like what is is mm. We even had yeah. a Batman assignment once where we needed to to go <laughs> to create a storyboard um, for it. Uh, this is me realizing that Catherine doesn't have bangs. Oh, <laughs> it suited her though. Yeah, mm -hmm. and Simona was um, was waiting for a teacher to say the Batman assignment. Uh, assignment. So she was just like sitting in her corner and she was just like saying say it and their teacher like looked over to her and was like what is this and she was like say it please just say it yeah our teacher got very confused and then he's just the dark knight assignment and she was just yes yeah <laughs> and this is ines um who is who is one of our classmates too and one of my good friends and uh <laughs> her only um 
when she heard you were gonna do it, she was just yes. Yeah, the only me. thing she wanted for her own drawing was to make it as derby and as weird and as um, messed up as possible. <laughs> And this is me trying to color skin and realizing that I don't know what I'm doing and redoing all of the skin colors a lot of times and putting in other colors and realizing I don't know what I'm doing with those colors either. <laughs> and Skin uh, colors are hard. Skin colors are hard and especially yeah. because like you want to make it different and you want to make it individual but at the same time it's like... Uh, it's difficult to not just make everything the same yeah. and still because it's very few nuances mm. that actually makes a difference but it does make a difference yeah i saw once a video uh i think it was maybe penilla Ørum. Mm -hmm. i saw she talked about that she had been going in and finding uh, screen caps from old disney movies and then color picked the princess's skin skin oh, color that's clever. and then she like modified it a bit adjustments and stuff so it looked more like real people and they were a bit more different but then she used that for skin color and then she would go in and be like oh yeah then i'm gonna do the aerial skin color and then maybe <laughs> adjust it a bit or something yeah that was actually a pretty good yeah uh, good idea i even need to do that it is yeah. but color is an important part and it does like it, it can really make a difference when in a piece so it's it's really important to get down good colors <clears throat> but sometimes it's hard, especially to like find the right balance and different people use different techniques and I've tried to not go too black on any of the um, clothing items and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. uh, Victoria's hair is completely black along with um, the, the helmet. biker helmet yeah. as some of the only things in here. Um, also Simona's shirt and Catherine's shirt? No, Sim Simona's shirt is, is dark brown, oh. actually. Oh. Catherine's is completely black. Mm -hmm. But just to like give give a bit of play, that way you can also add shadows. I, I kind of like not to go completely 100% oh, yeah, black with... with uh, Sorry. No, no, it's fine. No. <laughs> with with the colors. Yeah. And um, this is me trying to draw Stina and not remembering what she's wearing. And later on, you will see me changing her design again because I was talking to Victoria and I was like, does this look like something Stina would wear? And Victoria was like, no. And I was like, no, you're right. So. Uh, I feel bad for you sometimes. <laughs> This is me trying to make the glasses gold and realizing, no, that was a bad idea. And trying I to make that background. a derby background. <laughs> I just wanted to something, something more simple yeah. and something to go along with the cartoony style. This is trying to, to have the uh, shadows and the light um, tones fixated. Mm. Um, a good idea is to, to find out what, what sort of light you want. And then um, if you use um, the M tool, yeah, yeah, you can just uh, inverse it, invert it in, yeah, um, yeah. in Photoshop and then you will get the exact opposite color and you might need to make it a bit darker and um, a bit less saturated for it to, to look nice. But um, it, yeah, this is me changing Stina. Woohoo! <laughs> um, and it will give you a nice complementary um, shadow and light that will work great with each other. Um, it will also help the piece in general to look more unified, even if yeah. you use a lot of weird colors. Yeah, that's the thing. Uh, we had a color class where our teacher was very made sure that, that, that we understood that you can add as many weird colors as, as you want. It's all about making the light and the shadow work together that that brings all the colors together in the end if you don't mm. add the same or not the, it's it's more about adding the light and the shadow than anything else yeah so i think we're about to end yeah this is about it guys i'm just adding in the last sort of light now to make it shine a tiny bit more uh trying to add some effects just because why not and That's this is the final. finished piece Yay. um I thank you for really nice. watching along yeah 
See you next time. Bye. Bye.